what is up guys looking for the best indoor CCTV camera you have come to the right video so today we'll be looking at the best indoor CCTV camera for outdoor CCTV camera I'll be doing a separate video so make sure to watch that video as well because the specification on the outdoor CCTV camera as well as the features differ little bit than this indoor CCTV camera so in this video I'll be suggesting only two models I'll not be going like best five top five and all those things just two models out of those whichever you like you can easily buy them these cameras will be sharing same specification and you'll be getting all the good features out here to these cameras before we buy any indoor cctv camera here are a few things you should be knowing first one is the resolution or picture quality image quality whatever you say so resolution minimum you have to look for the 2 megapixel camera and the lens or the camera should actually be 2 megapixel not like they have written on the box and when you buy it and when you actually look at the image quality you'll be like very disappointed is this even 2 megapixel so that should not happen to you make sure you buy the proper model or check the description for latest updated pricing and model recommendations resolution what resolution you'll be looking at 2 megapixel that gives you like full HD recording as well as live streaming okay next one is 3 megapixel if you stretch a budget like 4 to 500 rupees more you'll be getting 3 megapixel and then you also have 4 megapixel with the 3 megapixel you can record it up to like 1296p resolution because this resolution depends on the aspect ratio that it is capturing 4 is to 3 16 is to 9 so based on that I'll not be going in depth in explaining all those things will be very simple here and straightforward so that it helps you take decision if you buy the 4 megapixel you are getting QHD which is 1440p resolution and the models that I am recommending now will also do that as well. So the second thing that you should be looking for is SD card expansion at least 128 GB should be there or 256 GB is really good and all these cameras have a smart tracking feature so whenever you see any movement any talk any noise so you will be notified on your phone even it captures the screenshot there or rather picture there and notifies you that someone is moving or somebody is talking there you can quickly look at that and all these cameras share Wi-Fi features connection to this indoor CCTV camera you need the Wi-Fi network which means you should have an internet in order to get it first connected to the as uh, indoor CCTV you can use the mobile hotspot but then again I would not suggest that instead you buy or have an internet subscription and then connect it to the CCTV camera so that's really important here that way you get proper streaming without any hiccups or struck or something like that okay so this indoor cctv camera should have like ethernet cable as well if you are looking for or say you have already some cameras fixed say outdoor cctv cameras and you are recording it on the dvr so you can easily take one ethernet cable and fix it to the uh, indoor cctv camera just like this so you should have this ethernet cable as well so that will help you in longer term and all these cctv cameras have the two-way communication which means it has the speaker as well as microphone so you can wherever you are uh, with the internet access you can easily talk and they will listen right in the room here where you have uh, fixed the camera and they can also communicate to you so that's two-way communication so these are basic necessities for the indoor cctv camera so the first camera that i'm recommending here is from tp link so they have named it tap Tapo, Tapo or whatever you call it. So it's the TP-Link C200. They have three models here. C200 for 2 megapixel resolution which means full HD recording 1080p. So there is 3 megapixel resolution C210 model. The pricing here is like 4 to 500 rupees difference for each model. So C200 gets 2 megapixel full HD recording. C210 gets 3 megapixel 1296p recording and 4 megapixel C220 model which gives you like 1440p QHD recording. Second model that I'm recommending if you're not a fan of this TP-Link is the Emo you CCTV camera emo you indoor CCTV camera that's here so it's been doing really good I have been using it for like uh, three to four years now and there have been no issue absolutely at all it also has the micro SD card and you also get the Wi-Fi connectivity Ethernet cable so the streaming is really good picture quality is also great and two-way communication is also really good so it's the emo 360 degree 2 megapixel camera so this one records at full HD so you can also stream it at full HD on your mobile phone. You can buy any one of these model from TP-Link or you can buy it from the EMOU. So all of these cameras get pretty much the same specification and share same features. So no matter which one you buy one of these, you'll be really happy with the performance. So hopefully this video was informative. I have not gone to too many models confusing you. Simple buy the TP-Link or buy the EMOU version. So hopefully this video was informative to you. If yes, hit that like button. Don't forget to share it with your friends and if you like these kind of videos or if you're new to my channel don't forget to click on that subscribe button so i will see you in the next one until then take care everyone bye bye